prologue this morning with Mitch Van Vliet. How well are you going to do this year? Um, my main goal is to finish and then uh, if I can back that up coming in the top position it'll be even better but I'm aiming for top five. Um, I got eighth last year but I had a few problems so uh, if I can get top five I'll be really happy but yeah the main thing is just to finish. A lot of things can go wrong in Fink as, um, as you can see when you watch last year's DVD and they do the results at the end and I can over half of them have D and F next to their name so um, yeah main goal is just to finish. And you feeling good about the Yamaha? I'm feeling really good about Yamaha, I'm loving the bike, um, it's been really good to me, it handles a treat. We went out, um, we just rode at one of the motocross tracks up here that's um, pretty whooped out to set the suspension up. Um, I got it set up to somewhere, I'm really, really happy with it. Um, the Fox shocks um, are handling a treat, so um, yeah, I'm stoked. Cool. And uh, you'll be watching out for kangaroos? Yeah, I'll keep my eye out for kangaroos this time. Um, they got big ones up here. Yeah, no, the kangaroos are a lot bigger up here, and um, I, don't, I really don't want to hit them. I, I think if I don't see them coming, then they won't hit me. It's when I look at them, they seem to they seem to come for me. So, so if I see one, I'll just look away and pretend it's not there. So, yeah. <laughs> all right, cool. We'll talk to you later. Thank you. G'day, we're here with Mitch Van Vliet at the Fink Desert Race down at Fink. How do you think it went today? Um. I'm not too sure. I think I'm coming in fifth at the moment. Um, first day, I just I rode safe today, so just so I could get through the day, and then uh, I'll race home tomorrow and see if I can pick up a bit of a pace. Sounds alright. Did you find your fuel stops good? Yeah, I, um, I thought I missed the second one, but it was further along the track than I thought it was. Um, they said it was just at the 60k mark, but it was like at this, it was about 165. And the whoops, how were they? Yeah, they, they were a bit um, up and down. <laughs> up and down. Sandy. Nice. And how do you think your Yamaha handled through the whoops? Yeah, the Yamaha was sick. Didn't miss a beat. Um, didn't even get bucked at all. So the Fox shocks were working awesome and and, uh, and, the, and all my Lone Star gear as well. So everything on the Yamaha and everything that's been attached to the Yamaha is working a treat. Um, can't complain with anything so yeah I was happy that's good and who's supporting you through the Fink Desert Race um, well we've got um, mum and dad here they, they drove down the bus um, we've got Adam Smen's my mechanic from Quad Squad my brothers Harry and, Harry and Cooper yourself yeah um, I'm pretty I'm pretty sick dude help out where I can really and then um, I've Got my girlfriend here as well, Shannon, and then Jake's been keeping mum and dad up, updated. For, uh, he's been watching it live on the internet back home, so he's been ringing mum and dad, telling them about my whole shot at the start and that, so yeah. Alright, sounds good. We'll see you down at Dallas. Yeah. We're here with Dutch Love, he's coming third. What happened? <laughs> um, well, today was a lot better than yesterday. Um, I actually got some motivation and, and went quick. I got through the whoops pretty quick, so um, I caught. I was running. I think I was running fifth on day one, and I caught the caught two of the people in front of me in the first whoop section. Um, I did, yeah, I just had a didn't really care attitude and just held it. And um, yeah, she held through. The Fox Shocks were awesome um, this weekend. Um, the Yamaha didn't miss a beat. Um, didn't even make a funny noise, so um, super happy with the Yamaha. Um, today felt so good. Didn't change anything, but um, last night, but I don't know, just felt a lot better than it did did yesterday. So um, I was over the moon um, once I passed those people. It gave me even more motivation just to just to hold it and uh, get through it. Good stuff. Well done. Thank you. Thanks.